Is there no, any Paul's fine. Paul's fine. You know, obviously, uh, we, we want more out of him. Uh, but but we're getting a lot out of him. And, you know, I think, unfortunately for Paul, is he's an offensive player, and, and that's what everyone sees in him. Uh, he has a defensive role in this series, and so they're going to look at his offensive numbers. And, and that's the bad part of being Paul Pierce, really. Uh, you know, if it was Tony Allen, he would be happy. You know, he's doing a great job defensively, but it's Paul. Uh, and so they want more, and we're going to get more out of Paul. Uh, you know, I believe that. He also but, talked about the impact foul troubles early in the game. Yeah, I think over anything, um, you know, having played that game, when you get early fouls, rhythm-wise, it, it takes you out of games, you know. And every game has been two early fouls, and it's, it's had an impact. Just don't start him. Yeah. yeah. Maybe bring him off the bench. Yeah. No, I don't think so. What, what is he giving you defensively? A body on LeBron, you know, it's going to take 48 minutes, and I thought last night he was the best at it, just at the afternoon, uh, in all the games, you know, in game two he's pretty good at it too, just trying to get into this airspace, uh, you know, it's a tough job, David, as you know, and they use him in so many ways, LeBron's different than a lot of the other great players, you know, the other great players, you know what they do, and it's usually the one thing. You know, LeBron runs point at times. He's the facilitator. He's the driver. He's their um, their speed player when they're trying to get into transition. He's their post player. I mean, does a lot of stuff. LeBron talked about maybe switching on Rondo. Is that a matchup that you still like? Even, even though yeah, we don't we don't care who guards Rondo. You know, uh, we're going to still run our stuff. It's not like we're going to stop running our offense. So uh, we anticipated it. I've only talked about it for three games. We know it's going to come at some point. In series and uh, when it does uh, we have to find a way of uh, using Rondo and, and making sure he's still the facilitator you know it's amazing the shots Rondo took last night was through the offense at the ball movement compared to game three where you can see Rondo try to just take the shots and be aggressive then no one else was involved I thought Rondo last night was had everyone involved and he still was aggressive offensively and that's the happy medium that we were talking about